Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration reading for all the Kansas um, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. It is the 17th, uh, 16 week of the year 2017, and the week begins from the 17th until the 23rd. I want to say thank you to each and every person who has been supporting my channels. Thank you for the likes and shares. I want to say to you also that we are now um, under the name of Katy Khan, so you can follow me on um, the YouTube videos, but yet still on. T uh, um, um, <laughs> on um, Twitter also and um, you can connect with me via clarity clarity is when we connect on um, voice to voice um, I don't know your number you don't know my number you can call me and we can have a conversation we can talk about anything you'd like to talk about so it's kind of nice with clarity but yet still um, not only doing clarity but also the readings uh, and as you all know that I do video readings I like video readings because they're much powerful um, people seems to connect more with the video readings and um, I do my things differently I'm sorry but I think video readings are like nice clarity is here so if you you know are having questions about certain things um, things that happen that you you're afraid to talk to other people about you can always connect with me um, you can go on clarity uh, the link is down is below and you can um, just make an appointment when you'd like uh, um, to talk I'd let you know if that day comes out or that time comes out together and your credit card and that's it so um, connect with me via clarity and we will talk the general energy for this week is the energy of um, the word the, uh, the energy of judgment and that is a general energy and uh, you have the energy of the three of swords in reverse okay so with the energy of the three of swords in reverse it's a wonderful good energy because you have no more art break no more art ache and uh, it is and it has come to the end of a situation okay so whatsoever situation that was going on whatsoever situation that was going on in your life whatsoever situation that is here in the 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 the, 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 the in love it's going to be very good in this week so uh, for the people who had an art break in love it's going to be a, a wonderful week you're going to connect and there's going to be a wedding so somebody will be also be asked to get married in this week so love is very vital in this week for you cancers and people uh, who are not yet connected in love relationship are going to be connected in love relationship I see weddings taking place celebrations but it has to do and then you're going to have a strong basis in your love life so this is going to be extremely good as we look at your week it's going to be a wonderful positive week I'm seeing um, the four of cups and the four of sword so it's going to be a week of rest and so the number four is going to be your energy vibration as we begin with Monday we have the five of ones the five of ones is always conflicts with other people the five of ones is going to be conflicts with other people so whenever we have the energy of the five of ones the conflicts that we are having with other people is going to actually go away okay because we have the four of ones so for each and every person in this week, you can see the number 44 is here. Three times four is here in this week. You have a strong foundation in whatever conflict that is going on, and it's going to be okay. You have a strong foundation. So be aware of what is going on around you at this moment, you can see. And uh, um, the foundation that is here is a strong foundation. So be aware of what the conflicts that is going on around you. As we look at the middle of the week, the Empress is here which is a wonderful energy so if there's a situation that has to do with your financial situation and um, it's more of your financial situation because the Empress is bringing your financial situation it's not really financial but your materialist your materialist needs the needs that you the, you need for your earthly day situation so say for instance you were you you have no more work and that sort of a thing and you are 
trying to find a way to solve your situation so that you can get your bills paid and this sort of a thing. The Empress is here in the middle of the week that is going to bring that to you, okay? On Thursday, we have the energy of the Two of Cups. The energy of the Two of Cups is here. And what this energy of the Two of Cups is doing is that it's bringing you a... Um, a uh, it's like it's bringing you someone to share your life. This is really love. This has nothing to do with business. Um, this is really love. At the end of the week, a loving situation is coming in. On um, Friday, you have the Three of Cups, which is a celebration. This celebration has to do with you're connecting with someone in a love sense, in a love relationship. And this commitment is going to be a celebrated one because maybe you're going out with a person for dinner, you're connecting with a person. Um, it's Friday, so you're going out, you're meeting someone new. This person is going to connect with you and it's going to help you. As we move along and we go, we look at the Four of Sword on Saturday. Have some rest, people. Rest, you need to have rest on Saturday. The energy vibration of you having rest on Saturday is extremely important in this week. So you need to have rest. On Sunday, you have the Four of Cups. And the Four of Cups is showing you a strong foundation in your um your love interest so for love what you're going to have for love in this week is that you'll be meeting someone for the people who will be meeting people new it's going to be a really good connection and for the people who um uh, who already is in a relationship is going to realize that you're going to be asked your end in marriage um you're going to be asked to connect together in some group. It's this is about um, love, and the, your week is a week of love and a week of uh, um, your personal growth, your personal growth, things that are happening in your personal life. So, you need to understand this sort of a thing, okay? It's all about personal growth so all the people who were going through an art break from the end of a situation end of a work situation the end of a love situation in this week it's going to be healed and this week the 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 um healing is coming in and the empress is here governing this week to help you to heal whatever your material lit um, your material needs needs will be okay so the healing is going to be in this week and it's going to heal whatever your material your material needs will be so I'm saying to you guys it's going to be extremely wonderful is it going to be wonderful yes it's going to be wonderful it's going to be a week where you're going to connect in with your the love partner and you're going to connect um, with the sense of bringing balance to a conflict that has been going on for a very long time. This conflicts you felt are broken about these conflicts. You have created those conflicts around yourself. I have been telling you guys this for a very long time that um, from since 2016 that whatever situation you have found yourself in, you have created for yourself and you have created around you. In this instance, um, someone very special is in your life, about to come in your life, is going to um, be there for you. This person is going to help you throughout um, certain situation. It's as if you had gotten yourself in a situation, but yet still your partner stood by you. And whatever heartbreak that you have um, uh, felt in the last couple of um weeks or months um it's 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 going to subside um it is a lesson it is a lesson for you you have done something that was unjust to someone else and it came back to bite you so i've always said if we do good we will receive good if we do bad we will receive what we give out okay what is bad bad is breaking down someone bad is bringing chaotic situation to people bad is when you honestly go out 
to make somebody's life be miserable okay and that is what you're going to get receive back in return because that is what you send out to someone else and that affects someone else's life and it is going to come back to affect your life at the moment in this week you are having and you're going to ask you the ends of someone in marriage and it will happen but it's not a marriage that is going to be made in heaven because this marriage is just a marriage of comforting because you need that comfort at the moment as soon as you have been totally healed from this heartbreak you will go back to your still your tricks okay it is your energy vibration I can't I'm only here to advise you and let you know what you are doing what vibration you are sending out but I can't change the way you think and the way you deal with things okay as we go forward and we're looking at the energies what we have in this week we are using the energy of the abundance I get this from my my angels and guide this is important please um, um, focus yourself on this card and this is going to bring you a message from the universe because I'm using the cards <coughs> sorry <coughs> message from the universe and it says actually it's not that you want stuff that you don't have but that you want stuff that you think you don't have and the best way to change this is to begin thinking that you have it all as in oh there is mine electricity full with a London loper and the cloud zipper okay so this is one of your energy vibration and the next one I have here which is another beautiful one this is special uh, these are not double because I've been having some double ones for the signs before and the next one you have it says uh, the tricky with spending money <laughs> lies in knowing whatever fiber of your beam that it will return and so it must okay so this is wonderful this is extremely wonderful focus on one of these cards and as I turn these cards around you will know which one of them to choose for your weak message okay so this one was the one with the mountains and the nice atmosphere this one was with the water and the sea okay so here we go again this is the back and this is the front okay and I want to say to each and every person out there, thank you for being here. Have a nice and wonderful week. And we'll talk next week.